this video we're going to talk about advanced fees app that is available on Clover devices. Natively using Clover today you can express line item fees which can be default uh, set up as a default fee uh, and those fees can only be expressed in the flat dollar amounts. Uh, they cannot be expressed in the percentage points. Similarly, using Clover native environment, you can set up service charges that are expressed to the entire order based on the percentage of the entire order cost. However, those fees can only be triggered manually by the employees during the transaction process. And so, with advanced fees, we've enhanced those functionalities to enable merchants to express fees either in flat fee dollar amounts or in the percentages and then those fees can be applied either to specific line items or to the entire orders. Further, using the Advanced Fees app, you can set up conditional statements, whereas during a single transaction, an employee is asked a question that would result on fee being applied or not applied on that particular order. So, let me quickly demonstrate how all of this functionality works with Advanced Fees. So first, let me quickly demonstrate uh, what Clover can do on its own without any involvement from uh, third-party apps. So if you go to Setup, you have Taxes and Fees, and in Taxes and Fees, you can set up a fee, a flat fee, right? And that's what I was talking about, that, you know, a, fat, a flat fee can be expressed as a dollar amount and it can never be expressed as a percentage and this uh, item fee basically can be set up and added to any item now what if you have a similar scenario but you need to express the fee in the percentage points so let me show you in our advanced fees app where we have this uh, I already set this one up so we have item that's expressed in the amount all right so then the other one there it is so we have an item fee percentage 35 percent and it's assigned to uh, specific items there these two items and so it's 35 percent fee uh, and it's triggered always rather than conditionally so let us demonstrate how that works in the register Oh, quickly remember the item. So water, let's say it's this one. And then you can see that the fee uh, got added. Um, and this is an example of a fee triggering based on a line item, based on the percentage points, and adding all the time. And let me choose a... Uh, different item perhaps this one and this is an example of a conditional do you want the fee added to the item let's go ahead and say yes and so the fee is added so that's the conditional statement item level fees now uh, let's go ahead and save this transaction uh, let's go back to the advanced fees and see um, if we can set up order level fee that's conditional uh, and as percentage based so first let's go into the setup okay and notice how there is additional charges um, so let's go ahead and call this charge you know order level convenience fee right and let's say that it's uh, three and a half percent three point five percent all right so you enable that service charge and natively it doesn't get triggered automatically but now when you come here you add a new fee 
you say that this fee needs to be order level and it needs to be percentage you see what happens is we pick up the 350 and the name from what you've set up in the app and then you can turn this on uh, and then say order save all right so now we have an order level convenience fee um, set up so let's quickly let's go to register app and let's grab one of these items here and now it's asking you if you want the fee added to the order all right and you say yes and so the fee is added and all the other items now that you're putting in the shopping cart order level convenience fee of three and a half percent is being added uh, on the order level and it shows up on the order level so there it is you can pay cash you can be done and the uh, fee gets shown here as well all right so as you can see combined with advanced fees and the native functionality on Clover with these two apps, the ability to express a fee uh, is extremely robust and virtually every scenario that you can think of is possible. Now, for the record, I'd like to say that it is not legal or allowed to offer surcharging on Clover devices.